that's quite nice. I think the sun might be coming out for this video. Good morning, everyone, and welcome back to my channel. Today, we've got a really fun and exciting video. We're switching it back. We're doing another sit-down fashion video, and this has been a very very highly requested one. I know I chatted in my trends video about capsule wardrobes and I feel like it was a little bit of like an anti-trend. It was something that I feel like is going to be huge this year but it's not exactly like a trending thing because obviously the whole point of having a capsule wardrobe is to have really classic timeless pieces that all go well together and seeing as though I thought it would be big this year I thought it would be the perfect time to chat about those pieces that are essentials in your capsule wardrobe particularly your winter capsule wardrobe so all those like essential items those foundations that will build your wardrobe and all of your winter outfits from the pieces that are just must-haves in your winter wardrobe i thought i would share my 12 i think i've managed to whittle it down to 12 winter capsule pieces my 12 winter essentials so let's jump straight into it now this first piece is going to be no surprise to anyone because I've been wearing it so, so much here on YouTube and also over on my Instagram and that is my favourite ivy and oak coat and I feel like one of the most key pieces to have in your winter wardrobe is a good quality wool coat, something that's going to keep you really warm, something that's going to be styled up or styled down and going to be worn in so many different ways and I can already tell you that I have gotten the wear out of this ivy and oak coat. I was really when I first picked this up whether to get this or black and I would say that if you are like me and you wear a lot of black you have quite a dark wardrobe a black wool coat is also a must but I decided to go for something a little bit different I went for this dark brown and actually I'm so so glad that I did because it's a little bit different from black it's a little bit more of a statement which I guess is a little bit of an oxymoron in a winter capsule wardrobe but it's still so timeless the colorway is just absolutely gorgeous and goes with everything in my wardrobe I have quite a predominantly neutral wardrobe and especially in winter I wear a lot of all black outfits so it's really nice to add a little pop of color in the brown coat I say color with a little bit of an asterisk there because I know that brown isn't really exactly the most bright or colorful color but it's just so so gorgeous and a wool coat is something that's going to keep you so so nice and warm in winter but also look really really smart for when you need it to but can be thrown over the top of any outfit I've worn this with leggings I've worn this dressed up for meetings I've even worn this when I've gone out for an evening meal it really has been my most versatile coat in my winter wardrobe and I definitely think is a must and I would say that investing in a really good quality wool coat is probably the best advice that I can give I will link some really gorgeous alternatives down below I'll try and find a really big mixture of price ranges of course I would recommend Ivy and Oaks this is the coat that I have and I absolutely have fallen in love with the brand but I know loads of other retailers that do some really gorgeous high quality wool coats like Warehouse, Coast, Karen Millen so I'll link a few down below but I would definitely say that you need a wool coat in your winter wardrobe. Next, let's talk about bags. Now, something that I didn't really mention in my trends video, which I feel like, again, is almost gonna be a bit of an anti-trend for 2023, is the death of the bag collection. It's something that I've seen a lot of people talking about over on TikTok, over on Instagram, but I feel like having a huge collection of loads of luxury handbags is kind of not really trendy anymore. It's not really in. People would rather curate a really lovely small collection of handbags, just two or three or four of some really gorgeous handbags that go with everything, that are timeless, that are classic that aren't necessarily like the bag to have in your wardrobe or the brand to be shopping at right now so I feel like a good quality handbag is really really key with your winter wardrobe for me the best brand that I can recommend is Mulberry I absolutely adore my Mulberry handbags I've got my mini Alexa here and my mini Bayswater you'll definitely notice that I am a small handbag kind of a gal I absolutely adore little handbags and I do have quite a lot of criteria when it comes to my bags and I like to make sure that they tick that criteria that I know that I'm going to get the wear out them so for me it's really important for my handbags to have a crossbody and a top handle because I like to be able to have different ways that I can hold them I like it to be a green leather so that I know it's going to last and I also like to make sure that they fit everything that I need and these handbags definitely tick all of those boxes for me so I would just say a really good quality crossbody handbag the kind of thing that you know you're going to wear time and time again in a really classic colorway whether that's tan or whether that's black the kind of thing that's going to go with everything in your wardrobe a good quality 
quality handbag is a must in a capsule wardrobe. Now, when it comes to footwear, there are two key items that I feel like I couldn't live without in my winter wardrobe. The first being a pair of knee high boots. Now, these boots have seen me through so many occasions, through so many different weathers, in so many scenarios, I could not live without them. Now, if you're a big calf girl, I am not gonna gatekeep this brand. I'm gonna let you in on a secret. Duo Boots is the brand that you need. They do amazing, really high quality leather boots for a bespoke size. So all you need to do is measure your calf, send in your measurements, click the one that you need, and you can get the boots to fit you exactly. And it's also great if you have smaller calves as well, because if you're someone that struggles with boots maybe not fitting your calves very well, you have a lot of room, you can actually get really, really small sizes as well. So I would definitely recommend checking out Duo Boots. They have so many gorgeous designs on there, but for me, a pair of black flat boots is just a must. I feel like heeled boots are a great one to add in, but definitely not a necessity. For me, I get so much more wear out of my flat boots because I can wear them to meetings, I can wear them when I'm dressing smart, I can wear them with leggings, I can wear them at the weekend. I've also, as you can probably see from the muds, worn them on a lot of winter walks recently, so they really are the most versatile pair of shoes that I have in my wardrobe. I am so sorry about the lighting. The sun is going in and out today. It's a little bit of a blustery, cloudy day, but the other pair of boots that I wanted to chat about, I was really debating between this and a different pair. I wanted to only include two pairs of shoes in this video and basically say to myself, if God forbid I lost my entire wardrobe, what two pairs of shoes could I survive with just those two pairs? for an entire month and I would definitely say that this is my second pair that I would add back into my wardrobe. This is my gorgeous pair of Vivaya ankle boots and I feel like ankle boots are quite an important one to have as well. It's great to have the knee-high boots but they don't go with absolutely everything. They don't work with all items in my wardrobe whereas these Vivaya boots are a great alternative if I'm looking for an ankle boot and actually have been so so great for day and night purposes. This is the epitome of the day to night kind of style and they're a really gorgeous pair of like ankle boots that are like stretchy, they're like a sock boot and they've got this really gorgeous chunky heel but the thing that I've just found with these boots is they are the most comfortable pair of boots I've ever ever owned. I discovered Vivaya as a brand last year and fell in love with them. They create eco-friendly sustainable shoes and it's absolutely amazing. These boots are actually made from plastic water bottles I believe it was. They are made from fully recycled materials which I just think is such an amazing brand to introduce yourself to in 2023 because I really do feel like they are paving the way for other footwear brands and I really, really love the feel of these. I love the way that they look. I love the way that I can style them up or style them down and they are just the most comfortable thing I've ever put my foot in. So I would definitely recommend checking out Bavaya. They are a great brand to look into this year. Now, when it comes to clothing, I really have discovered that I don't have the biggest collection of pieces that I want to wear on a day-to-day -day basis. I am such a creature of habit and if there's one thing that I could not live without in my winter wardrobe it is a jumper dress exhibit A, exhibit B. I absolutely love these and if you watch the vlogs regularly you'll know just how much wear I get out of these jumper dresses. These are actually new look jumper dresses. They cost under £30 and they are one of the most affordable yet luxury looking pieces in my wardrobe. I always get so many compliments when I wear these dresses. They're really easy to start, really easy to wear because they've got this ribbed fabric. Even though they're a bodycon, they are super, super flattering and so easy to start for so many different occasions. If it's a little bit chilly, you can chuck some thermals on underneath, pair with your wool coat and you are ready to go. I feel like a jumper dress is such a must in your winter capsule wardrobe because you literally have so many styling options, so many outfit choices, and so many places that you can wear these. Wow, it's getting sunny, my goodness me. Now the next piece that I feel like, again, is a must in your winter capsule wardrobe is a good old fashioned roll neck. There's a reason why these come into style every single winter. They're stunning, they're classic, they're practical, they're timeless. I have so many compliments that I can give roll necks, regardless of what color you want to go to. I really feel like when it comes to color palettes, it's really key to nail the kind of colors that you want to wear most of the time. So whether it's white, whether it's browns, whether it's neutrals, whether it's blacks, a roll neck in your kind of color palette is so, so key to add into your winter wardrobe. Again, they're really easy to style. I feel like there are loads of different ways that you can style these up or style them down. If you're looking for something a little bit more casual, pair with leggings, your knee high boots, and you can wear them for a walk. If you want something a little bit more elevated, maybe a slip skirt, some heeled boots, and a cute little blazer, and you've got a day of meetings outfit. I feel like they're just so, so key at making your winter outfits. They're like a real 
base to your winter looks and that's what I absolutely love about them. Another item that I feel like makes up the foundation of a lot of my winter outfits is a cable knit. I feel like there are loads of different cable knits out there whether you're looking for something a little bit more expensive or something a bit more of a high street alternative. Cable knits are just a classic and no matter where you get them from I've always found that they look really chic, really luxurious and really expensive. So my favourite ones personally are my Ralph Lauren ones. I have quite a few different colours in these now. I've got this gorgeous tan, I've got black, I've got white, I've got green and I love reaching for them time and time again again. They're the kind of thing you can style up so easily and so timelessly. They go with absolutely everything and they never ever date. I also think H&M is the best place to look for for cable knits if you're looking for a high street alternative because they look so expensive, they last so long but are so so affordable. So I will link a few options down below but a cable knit is another must in your winter capsule wardrobe. Now something that I feel like has come up time and time again as I've been chatting about these outfits and chatting about these pieces is a pair of leggings. I feel like investing in a really good pair of quality leggings is so, so important. I am someone that does not like wearing jeans. I don't like anything that's tight on my waist. It's not gonna be comfortable to wear. Stretchy trousers are the way forward for me, especially if you just want a nice, cozy winter outfit. They pair so well with jumpers. They pair really well with boots. They look gorgeous underneath your wool coat. You see how much all these pieces are coming together and how you can style them all so many different ways but I feel like a pair of black leggings is really, really key. One thing I will note though is that there are lots of different leggings out there and looking for a good quality pair is the most important thing that I can hound you guys on. There is nothing worse than being able to see your pants through your leggings. I personally prefer to wear a longer line jumper with leggings anyway, just to make sure that there's nothing showing it through. But the best place to look for for leggings is actually M&S. And I feel like I need to apologize to my mum for hounding at her whenever she would try and get me to shop there when I was a teenager. m and is actually such a great place to look for for clothes. They also do longer versions and petite versions of the leggings so you can get them to your perfect size. And as a petite girl, I very much appreciate not having to roll them up thousands of times on my ankle. Now, as we are talking about a winter capsule wardrobe, we know we're going to want to be warm, we're going to want to be cozy, and we're going to want to look for fabrics that are going to keep us that way. And cashmere is definitely the number one fabric that I would recommend looking into this winter. I know it's a little bit more of an investment, I know it's a little bit more spenny, but it's totally, totally worth it for the warmth, the comfort that it brings. And actually, one of the places I would definitely recommend checking their cashmere out is Bowdoin. H&M also have some really gorgeous pieces and so do M&S but I'm really loving the Bowdoin cashmere at the moment. It's super soft, super easy to wear and super timeless. I've got two pieces here, a really gorgeous camel colour and a really lovely bisky pinky tone. I just think these look so, so gorgeous. They're so easy to style and keep me really nice and snugly warm in winter. So whether it's a cashmere jumper you're looking for, a cashmere jumper dress, scarves, accessories, looking for cashmere in the fabric mix is such a great way of making sure that you're adding the best pieces that are going to keep you so warm this winter. And speaking of warmth, I feel like we can't negate our winter accessories. So when it comes to scarves, I always look for, again, the fabrics that I can add into my wardrobe. Now, this is actually a really gorgeous totem scarf, and this is 100% virgin wool. I always found wool in the past to be quite itchy. I was never someone that really got on well with it. It was a fabric that I avoided quite a lot until I discovered Totem's virgin wool. And let me tell you, this is the softest, coziest, loveliest scarf I think I've ever added into my wardrobe. I've worn it so, so much throughout winter. And actually, I really love how versatile it's been. It's been the kind of scarf that I chuck on when I go on a winter walk. I can wear it over my shoulders if I want more of like a blanket cape style. I wear it on my lap when I'm on car journeys. It's so, so so timeless and a great item to add into your winter wardrobe if you're looking for something that's really going to help you pull all your outfits together tie them all nicely and add a lovely very very fashionable layer of warmth now this next piece i'm not gonna lie it's something that i really toyed whether to add into this video or not because i feel like a lot of people might not argue that it's a key piece in your capsule wardrobe but i personally would say that in winter it definitely definitely is i'm a very cold-blooded person i get cold so easily my hands go numb my lips go blue i get so grumpy so i always like to make sure that i've got pieces with me to stop that from happening and i feel like a pair of gloves is key when it comes to winter styling particularly a gorgeous pair 
of well-fitted leather gloves. I know I've been doing my petite girl guides over on Instagram and if you've been watching them, you'll know that one big recommendation I have when it comes to gloves is making sure that you've got some well-fitted gloves. There is nothing more unflattering and nothing worse than wearing a pair of floppy, oversized gloves that don't fit your hands. So this is a really gorgeous pair from Macintosh. It's a brand that I recently discovered this year and I got these in a small and they are the most gorgeous, well-fitted, stunning pair of gloves I've ever, ever owned. They're also like lined on the inside. So they're really cozy and really, really warm. And I've worn these so, so much throughout winter. They're a great one to throw in your bag because they're not very big. They're really, really easy to chuck in your handbag and have with you as a just in case. And you can wear them for so many different occasions. I've worn these at bonfire night. I've worn these when I've gone for meetings. I've worn these for light trails, winter walks, you name it. I will whip out my gorgeous leather gloves to keep myself nice and snugly warm. So I definitely think they're a bit of a must when it comes to winter wardrobe essentials. I will link some of my favorites down below because you're not gonna regret picking yourself up a classic and timeless pair of winter gloves. Now, speaking of practical items, the other coat that I would recommend having in your wardrobe is a gorgeous puffer. I really had to think about this video. I did a lot of prep and a lot of planning. I'm really trying to say to myself, if I had to start my wardrobe from scratch, what are two coats that I could literally style my entire wardrobe with and just live with those two? And I would say the wool one is definitely more of like a weekend coat. It's the kind of thing you can wear to meetings. You can style up or style down. This is definitely my practical walking countryside coat and as someone who now lives it down in Hampshire in the New Forest this is a serious must in my wardrobe it's a really gorgeous Fairfax and Favour long line coat I actually have two different colours of this coat now I've got this one and I've also got the shorter version in khaki which I absolutely love it's called the Charlotte coat and it's so cosy and so warm I feel like padded coats are really coming back in this year they're a big trend that I'm definitely noticing in 2023 particularly long line padded coats and I think they are so such a must in your winter wardrobe if you're like me you want to stay nice and cozy still look chic but you want something super practical this is a definite must for you and the last item that I feel like is seriously key when it comes to winter wardrobe styling and I feel like really make up the foundation of your winter capsule wardrobe. Looks a little bit funny, but it is a good pair of thermals. I really do feel like when it comes to winter styling, it starts from underneath. It starts from that base layer. I like to make sure that my elbows look streamlined, that they're still flattering, that they still look really, really lovely. And a great way to do that is to make sure that you're layering from underneath rather than from over the top. So adding in a good pair of thermals into your winter wardrobe is so, so so key. I am actually going skiing at the end of the month so I've been adding lots of new thermals into my wardrobe so I do have a video coming up all about the pieces I'm taking skiing with me so if you haven't hit that subscribe button already and you don't want to miss that make sure to hit the subscribe button now but just for the UK just for a really affordable key piece is this really really gorgeous pair of tights and they are actually fleece lined these are from Amazon they are absolutely game changer you can get them in the skin color you can get them in black you can get them in lots of different shades as well so even if you're not a pale girly like me if you've got darker skin tone you can get the perfect shade to match your skin tone so I will leave them linked down below because they really are key in your winter wardrobe they are so perfect when the weather gets really chilly and you want to be super cozy and super layered up they've been absolute game changers for me it's a good pair of winter thermals again Again, it's an absolute must in your winter capsule wardrobe. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video and enjoyed seeing some of my winter wardrobe staples. These are all pieces that I know I've definitely gotten the wear out of and have really made up the foundation of my winter outfits and all of the pieces that I have been styling throughout the last few months. If you are looking to create a winter capsule wardrobe, I definitely recommend starting with these pieces and then growing from there. Of course, everything will be linked down below if you do want to shop anything from this video. And don't forget, I'm uploading three days a week throughout January and of course for the rest of the year. But I really hope you guys enjoyed the video and I will see you in my next one. Bye!